Hello, embedded engineers, developers, and professionals all over the technology space. Welcome to In Case You Missed It, Embedded Insights, the weekly news show all about embedded technologies and solutions from your friends at Embedded Computing Design. I hope you U.S. folks all had a wonderful holiday weekend and that you remembered to listen to the traditional Alice's Restaurant Massacre protest song. Join the movement. It's Friday, December 4th, 2025. I'm Ken Briota, Editor-in-Chief of Embedded Computing Design and your host, and these are our top stories this week. First up, Aeon has introduced its brand new Com ARH C6, a Com Express Type 6 compact size module. It uses Intel Core Ultra processors, uh, Series 2, including the Core Ultra 9, 7, and 5 processors. And the company says it achieves up to 99 tops of AI performance, so check that out. Our next story uh, comes from Solid Sands, which recently announced that it is acquiring Plum Hall technology and test suites. According to the release, the acquisition will allow Solid it sands the ability to extend its market value and open new corridors for growth while delivering innovative solutions. Solid Sands is reportedly looking to enhance its involvement in programming language standards, especially in major changes introduced in C23, C23, and the upcoming C26. For our featured column this week, we're showcasing Joseph Sestari, VP Semiconductor Operations at ABM, who writes that the domestic semiconductor industry industry is at a critical juncture, and he wonders if we are on the cusp of unprecedented growth or standing on the edge of a cliff. Either way, he asserts the answer is innovation, so give it a read and see how he gets to that conclusion. Finally, we're featuring EMAS, which will showcase its ECSDOT Milliwatt AI SOC at CES 2026, coming up in the first week of January. According to the release, the SOC is a Milliwatt class on-device AI platform designed to deliver all always on intelligence with ultra low latency and reduced power consumption. So check that out. And on that topic, I will be at CES in Las Vegas to see everything that's new in consumer facing embedded technology innovations. Although as we all know, there's plenty of behind the scenes tech to be seen there as well. Reach out while you can to schedule time to get together while I'm in town and download our resource, the top six things every exhibitor should do at CES to find out some of the ways you can enhance your presence if you are an exhibitor. The link for that is down in the description and uh, make sure you reach out to me. You can also find my my information down there. But that's it for this week. Make sure you look for the In Case You Missed It LinkedIn newsletter for even more stories that you don't want to miss. That comes out every Monday on, as you might have guessed, LinkedIn. Subscribe to that newsletter and to us here on YouTube so you never miss any of our shows. Visit embeddedcomputing.com for all the news in the embedded computing space and follow us on LinkedIn and all across the web. While you're subscribing, hit that notification bell so you never miss one of our episodes of In Case You Missed It, Dev Kit Weekly, or any of our other shows, programs, and podcasts. Please reach out to me if you'd like to advertise on In Case You Missed It or sponsor a series of episodes. And I will see you next week. Thanks, everybody. Have a great weekend.